Hi everyone, my name is Neftali Mijan and I'm a Beachbody coach with Team Live Active. I just want to ask you one simple question. What keeps you from hitting your goals? Is it just one thing? Is it a collection of different things? Maybe you don't even know. Do you ever find yourself just looking for something to blame for it? You know, eventually we always come to the same realization and that is that the only thing or person to blame is you. It's always you. You may completely disagree with me here, and trust me, I would understand if you do, but when you step aside and you really ask yourself, what kept me from reaching that goal? The only thing you can blame it on is yourself. And I know this because I too was once there. I used to make every single excuse under the sun just to soften the blow of the disappointment that would happen once I didn't reach a certain goal. Making excuses sometimes has a comforting effect. You know, it makes you feel like it's not as bad as it seems. But in the end, those excuses always mount up to the same thing. Whatever goal you set passes you by and you're just, you're just left there in the wake of it. Feeling upset and feeling helpless. Trust me, I know how it is. And it almost seems like it's an endless cycle, but there is a way out of it. We tend to stick to things that other people are counting on us for. Yeah, we can make excuses all day long about ourselves and fail and fail and fail until we've dug a giant hole that we can just put all of our missed goals inside of. But I guarantee you when somebody else says, hey, I need this from you, I'm pretty sure you drop everything to make sure it gets done. Am I right? Think about your job. When your boss comes up to you and asks you to complete a specific task, no matter what it is that you have on your plate, no matter what projects you're working on for yourself or for your team or whatever it is, I guarantee you put everything down and get that job done for your boss. Think about your daily life. You know, when your children say, mommy, I need this or daddy, I need this. I guarantee you they become your first priority. What about your significant other? You know, if you're in a relationship, I guarantee you that if your partner is suddenly having a bad day, you toss everything to the side just to make them smile. But all the while, everything that you want for yourself just keeps getting pushed and pushed and pushed further away until it's just a distant memory. It's pretty unfair. You should be pretty mad. You should be freaking angry. Are you there yet? Well, who are you gonna be angry at? You can't be angry at your boss. They're your boss. You can't be angry at your kids because they're your kids and you can't be angry at your significant other because let's face it, you're probably angry at them for other reasons. So don't waste it on this. So the only person at the end of the day that's left to be angry at is you. It's time to stop letting the world spend your time for you. It's time to stop bending over backwards for every little thing that comes by except for yourself. But if you're always making excuses as to why you can't finish things, how do you cure this problem? It's easy. You put yourself in a position where people aren't just looking for help from you, they're looking for direction. That's right. When you hold yourself accountable to improving someone else's life, something magical happens you begin to realize that more than anything, that person is really just looking for you to show them the path that they should walk. You know, anyone can follow directions, but it takes someone special to shape behavior. Now, I didn't realize this until a few years ago when I became a Beachbody coach. So as I said before, I had become a professional at making excuses for everything under the sun. The truth behind it was, I was lazy, tired, overworked, and I really had no idea what I was doing or what to do for myself. And it took the helping hand of a Beachbody coach to finally show me what I was capable of. I couldn't even see it for myself. They showed me how I could empower myself and gain confidence through daily exercise and taking care of myself nutritionally. It wasn't an easy journey. 
In fact, I still made a lot of excuses in the beginning, but they remained patient with me and they just kept motivating me and pushing me in the right direction and kept nudging me to make the right decisions. It didn't take very long for me to start adopting these behaviors and just making them a part of who I was on a daily basis. You know, and people started to take notice and they started to see that my body was changing and that my attitude was changing. And because of that, I started to attract people to me who wanted the same thing. They just didn't know how to get it. And then the interesting thing was I found myself once again doing things for other people. But this time I wasn't a slave to the time I committed to them. In fact, the more time I spent working toward their goals, the closer to my goals I got. I had heard a phrase, it's, it's through the service of others that we can truly find success. I've heard that before, but I never really understood it. You see, as a Beachbody coach, I know now that those who seek my help are really looking for someone to be a leader, you know, someone to show them what's possible, someone to show them, you know, that even when things look impossible, even when things have failed in the past, they can be turned around. And they finally realize that they too can succeed where they once failed because I won't let them fall. I won't let them fail. And I'll be honest, I wasn't always the leader that I am today, but I only got to this point by deciding to give myself a real chance. You know, being a Beachbody coach has given me the chance to change my life, but not to mention the hundreds of lives that I've helped improve along the way. So although this is my full-time job now, I've never, not even for one second, considered it work. What I do brings me happiness and it improves my life more and more every single day. So ask yourself, if anything I said today makes sense to you, if you felt like I was speaking right into your soul, if you need something to change so that you can control your own life again, maybe it's time you give yourself a real chance. I invite you to a free webinar where my team and I will explain everything it means to be a Beachbody coach. All you have to do is drop your email in the comments below and listen in. If it sounds like exactly what you need to recharge your life and finally hit those goals, then I would be excited to welcome you into our team and start helping you to build your dreams. And if in the end it doesn't sound like it's something that's right for you, no hard feelings. I still welcome the opportunity to be able to talk to you and find out if I can help you in any way possible. Listen, thank you for your time and I look forward to helping you realize the life that you have imagined for so long. Have a great day.